talking level two ganks here. Panaton blink forward has damage. <laughs> Did its worst case scenario. Yark on Lancelot with Blue Stone might be happening to Relentless One again here. Stun this time is good. Panatom and Yark will combine for another kill. And Relentless One had a level lead. It'll go by the wayside. Smart objective call from the Levi's pulls themselves just about 3,000 gold in the lead. There's Yikes. your solo kill. We figured it would happen. That's a stun onto Leon. He'll go up and over. Can he dodge out the powerhouse? Beads are good. You got to hit your autos, Griff. And the first kill of the weekend for the Calvin Wardens hit Zapman. With those auto attacks, seems to be the name of the game here. We'll see if he can do it up against Leon as both ultimates exchanged. <laughs> It's a game of chicken, but Zapman lands first, dodges out the last pow out chain. Shinto, an important trade out. So Zapman, the forgettable last couple of minutes, and the Wardens have been able. Wrong, you force to use the beads, and there's still a clock on the other end. Circle of protection won't roll through in time, and suddenly, and Zapman's got the damage for Gino. See ya. Gets a double kill on the Maz while Panatom runs over Leon. It's a triple kill for Zapman. Could be the quad around the corner. One more auto's all he needs, and Zapman has come back into the game with four. Zapman upset with being 66% of the deaths up against the SCC. Will pick himself up. Can live here. He's in trouble. Maybe even if Yark can't live here, this is still a worthwhile trade for the Leviathans. You lose your solo laner. Did he live somehow, no. Zapman? He's out of the fight, no. but he's still alive in the back line. Finally gets taken down, but he dealt a whole lot of damage before dying off into Probably the entirety have. of the Wardens, and he won't live for it. Shinto does turn around one onto Leon. Fire Giant, in the meantime, goes to the Leviathans. There's more lockdown onto Relentless One. Shinto's already got two. Zapman adds another. Panatom with one as well, and the Leviathans roll through the Wardens into a world of pain with Zapman on the backside, and Zapman with his six of the game. Leviathans fans, can breathe a bit of a sigh of relief here. There's already one kill. Has dropped the for strife. the Levi's. Double strife. How many times have I said that? And the last team fight of the game looking good for the Levi's, and so is game number one. Moswell is able to make his way back to Fountain. Can't say this was the aim of the other three members of his team. The Leviathans cleanly able to close this one out. And, and it's just objective play, isn't it, throughout the early game that nets them this... It's going to be fun to watch. Uh, look, so we're getting the, the ESET support once again. The Charybdis, though. And, and, and this is actually a fun because would we... In from Griff. Remember, no beads for wrong you. All the stuns and the damage. It's all connecting. Full effect from the Kalin Wardens in first blood. In LA. Oh, no. He's going to get taken down from range by wrong you. And the Leviathans even up the score at one. Ion has got to make the moves happen. And Windfire Wheels defensively will make Ooh. it happen. Moswell's not going to survive the third gank to mid, though. And finally, and Panatom gets real low here. Zapman walks forward, takes the heart bomb. He's okay. And will get out and live. Ends up grabbing the assist, but Shinto is the one who gets the kill. Man, Charybdis just fits Zapman's styles. And Relentless One finds Shinto in mid. I'm thinking he's dead 100%, yeah. but the ability to get out of that heart bomb, so, so valuable. Ends up turning it back around. Windfire wheels this time on to Panatom. Should be the damage from the Levi's, and it is, but Griff immediately turns around to kill. Looks like on the left side okay. of the map as the Wardens are continuously trading back into the Leviathans. And suddenly Gino is the target of all of the Leviathan stuns, roots, all of it connecting. And Gino doesn't stand much of a chance. Okay. Relentless one, big initiation though from the chalk. But the Kalen Wardens just, and down he will drop, and down he will go. Finally, some follow up on one of the initiations from L.A. Own. From Shinto, provides a bit more damage, and Spirit Ball deals the killing blow. Wrong you and the Levi's. And my god, the damage that this Osiris does. It's just not enough still. Somehow, Moswell turns it around and burns down Panatom, as L.A. Own is gonna get chased out by the damage from Shinto. And wrong you will receive the burst heal this time. Yarkor and Panatom in a 2v2 against Griffin, Relentless One over in mid. Shinto does end up getting the kill onto Gino. Should be another one here for Panatom, but it's a trade out. Makes his way forward. Gino gets ulted by Yarkor. Shinto on a killing spree. The Leviathans, a bit of momentum now. You've lost the FG. You'd love to take away as many of those buffs as possible. Could be another one here onto Relentless One. Should be another one here. 
And Shinto with a double drops the second buff. As Leon has found an initiation on a Panaton, but not the target he was hoping for. Relentless one, burn Woo. down. And Shinto will end this game, likely on a rampage, as an ultimate from Yark connects. And again, bend becomes break for the Kowlin Wardens, the Leviathans burst forward and they'll take game two in the set over the Calvin Warden. I can't believe Zatman in the 38th minute gets the double kill you've been calling for. Gino stepping forward, but not much he could do. The Leviathan's just so methodical in their approach to base siege off of the back of one fire giant, able to find themselves the win. Too much damage, like, yeah, but no one really hits all of it. Well, Shinto does. <laughs> yeah, no. And when he does, it, it, it one shot, it does a ton. And then the, the commanding there, yeah, about 40K. Just, just you know, another day for Shinto, Just right? Shinto things, that's yeah. Li that's very, lightweight. Very calm, relaxed. Uh, I got to give shout outs to Hardcore as well, because keeping up with uh, the damage coming out of him, and Zap. Of course, uh, we saw Levi's take on the Wardens. Next, it's going to be the Valkyries and the Hounds, your first seed there for the SCC.